So, how do you want? So, this video I'm going to teach you how to use string tokenizer in Java. So, first let me tell you what is the use of string tokenizer. String tokenizer is basically used to uh, display a particular string or a sentence in a form of separate words line by line. So, that's uh, basic use of string tokenizer. So, it's for actually first we need to import it. It's actually present in the util package. So, import java dot util dot I see string tokenizer. So there are multiple options over here. You need to select string tokenizer. Just select it. And once you've done that, this is just a main class. I've just created a main class and a function. Wide main function. So just, just basic things. And next thing you need to declare a variable, which is a variable of our object of, of the string tokenizer class. So it's going to be string tokenizer, as you can see here. String tokenizer, name of the class can be str maybe str equal to new string tokenizer okay and here here will be that variable okay it can be a sentence probably okay let, let me just type a sentence this is a book okay this is going to be a sentence and now we need to print it so for printing this we would require uh, while loop or a for loop, I would say while loop is better because you can also use a condition over there. So that returns true or false. So that can basically terminate the while loop when it returns false. So condition is so str is the name of a string. So it's going to be str dot. And as you can see, here, a bunch of methods that we are getting for our string token is here class. So it's going to be has more tokens, which generally uh, it's like a end of uh, what to say, it's like. A read function in a file basically if the it, it returns true if there are any words or strings or characters present in a sentence and it returns false if it's come to an end okay that's what the main function is and and we are just going to print it so it's going to be system dot out dot print ln so it's good to do in print ln so it's printing the so it's going to be str dot same thing and it's going to be next token okay this will just print it okay print each thing token refers to here each word person in the signal so we are good to go that's it so as you can see here the output we have got separated by each word okay so where is this string tokenizer is useful if we are not so and it is useful mainly used when comparing words Suppose if you want to search a particular word in a sentence, instead of, you can't use for loop to iterate through words in a particular sentence. So, so, so in that case, string tokenizer comes in more handy and more in case useful. And also, not only has it also has many number of fun methods. Okay, as I told you, it has count tokens, equal more tokens, hash code, next element. So it has a wide variety of things. Okay, you can also try it out by using this. So that's it. Thanks for watching. And I have done also many tutorials in Java. And in C, C++, Unity, Blender, finally check out other videos and thanks for watching.